Welcome back. After our recent success at the Ashes... We, uh, we lost. Did we? Yeah. Oh, it's probably a good reason for that. It's grassroots cricket. You see, what's happened is that over the years we've got a little bit slack. Now, cricket starts at home, usually in the corridor. Mm -hmm. This, imagine this being your average corridor in your average home, right, in Australia. Now, one of the problems with corridor cricket, of course, and the reason why our cricketers are struggling at the moment, is that there is a bit of a damage factor, yeah? Okay, it can get a bit risky. Yeah. So what we're going to do now is we're actually going to reenact what would normally happen in a standard Australian home when playing corridor cricket, yeah. right? And then we'll show you what you can do. Okay. So I'm going to be, um, like, we're going to be kids, aren't we? Like, yeah. yeah. Okay, I'll be, uh, I'll be Shane Warne. Okay, right. right. So you'll be a kid playing the part of Shane Warne. Yeah. Okay. Get, get off your phone, Shane. Off your phone. Put the phone down, Shane. <laughs> Alright, so who, who, who are you going to be? Well, I should probably be Don Bradman. But... <laughs> Don't you reckon? Well, similar physique, yes. Yeah. <laughs> okay, All so, right. we're in the corridor. Okay, so we go, oh, I'm okay, Stuart. Oh, I'm seeing one down. Okay, ready? Sweep shot. Oh! <laughs> Problem is, <laughs> hole in the wall, yeah. mum's going to come home and kill you, right? This is how you do it, kids. Simple solution. Uh -huh. Get yourself a picture frame from around the house. Get rid of whatever picture's in it and put in a blank piece of paper like this, right? Then you get yourself some textures. Unreal. Yeah, see, this is the great one. This is how you get off the hook. Now, you just draw your own picture. I suggest a little sun. I like suns. Yeah, That's mum's good. like that, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then maybe uh, you get yourself a little, uh, a little house. So, yeah. you know. A house is good. Smoke yeah. coming out of the house. And, yeah, and uh, some windows there. It's chimney. And some doors and uh, like that. And chimney. Yeah, uh, chimney, get in there. Yeah, you know? Oh, good, right. good, good. Okay. Pollution. And um, we'll get some grass going there as well, right? So car. This is car. Car, yeah, later. Yeah. Uh, okay. Yeah. Most important thing. This is very, very important. To get yourself out of trouble with mum, what you have to do is you have to write this. We love you, mum. Oh, that's good. Right, okay, now you well, take this hang picture. On, hang on. What about dick and balls? No, that's probably not appropriate for this. Okay. <laughs> Thanks for checking though, mate. Well done. So what do you do? So you get your picture right, and before mum gets home, you just really easily place oh. your picture over the damaged wall. Oh. Now, what mum is going to come home and go, oh, my God, that's not the most fantastic thing I've ever seen? They're going to love that. Mums are sick for love. That's why they love love. <laughs> so, now we'll reenact as if mums come home. You'll have oh. to be the mum this time. Oh, OK. Oh. OK? <laughs> be one of those hot sort of tennisies, you know, sexy... No, don't. OK. <laughs> You know, you know, there's mums, you know, like soccer mums, but like tennis, you know? Oh, OK. Just do whatever comes natural. So now I'll be the kid. Oh, uh, oh hi, Mum. Oh, hello there. I've got a virus, so I won't be hugging you today. <laughs> OK. Um, oh, look. Yeah. You've um, made me a painting. Thank you very much. What happened is um, we thought how much we loved you, so then we made a picture and we hung it there, which is, because we're kids, seemed like a pretty normal place to put it. <laughs> That's fabulous. I don't think we'll ever mention this ever again. That'd be good. I'm clearly off the hook, aren't I, Mum? Mm. And there you are. <laughs>